I'll adjust. It's a little, yeah, yeah. that's okay. All yeah, right, um, Perfect, Senator, obviously a great outpouring for your father and well deserved today as the city prepares and the families to say your you know, final goodbyes to Moon Landrew, a giant in the city's history. Yes, we're just, the family is so honored and really just overwhelmed the outpouring of support and love and the most amazing stories about his life. And, you know, one thing I wanted people to know, and I think they understood, that my father just every day just wanted to be the best human being he could be. I mean, that's how he woke up every day. How can I be the best for me today? And then all of his good work came out of it. And so it's just been quite wonderful to reflect on that part of his life. And I mean, from the time I was as early as I can remember until this week, that was his goal every day, just be the best he could be. What stands out about his legacy? Well, he would say <laughs> Erica, Adam, and all of the kids and grandkids. I mean, you know, I would try to talk to him about all of his accomplishments. But Dad, you remember you did this and that. Mary Landrew, the thing I'm most proud of are you, the children, and my grandchildren. So forget the kids, okay? It's the grandkids <laughs> <laughs> that he was so proud of, and his great grands. And so, what would you like to, to say? Um, I mean, I was really had I had a blessed life, um, and I got to spend a lot of time with him. Um, and he really was just an incredible leader and a great role model to us, even when we were young. Um, he loved us so much every day. He loved us, um, and he always told us that he was proud of us, um, which really hits hard. Um, it even I, I got into law school recently, and um, I gave him a, a call, him and Mama a call. And I have his voice recording saying like, I'm just so proud of you. And I've listened to it over and over again. And it really just, it makes my heart warm. Um, yeah, I've just been thinking, you know, they say um, everything you learn in life, you learn in, you need to know in life, you learned in kindergarten. I think we could say everything we need to know in life, we learned from Papa. I mean, he taught us just to treat others with respect, that our ideas and our opinions matter, but so do those of others. And, um, you know, just to work hard is always a good time for an ice cream cone. <laughs> <laughs> Which was his favorite. Which was his favorite thing. Lunch, yeah. dinner, dessert, <laughs> doesn't matter. Ice cream cone. Ice cream cone. <laughs> Any particular flavor? I, I, I think sometimes a vanilla mixed with a chocolate, but Creole cream cheese was a treat. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you all so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.